The increasing demand of energy in a world affected by climate change has made the use of renewable sources more important. The commitment to reduce CO2 emissions taken by industrialised countries created the necessary framework for the development of appropriate technologies for the use of various renewable energy sources, such as biomass. NASA is a company committed to the development of renewable energies and develops technologies for the use of biomass in an efficient, reliable and sustainable way. absorb part of the solar energy and transform it into organic matter. Each year plants produce enough energy matter to cover five times the global demand but only a small fraction is used. There are several sustainable sources of biomass. The residues are forest waste, agricultural waste and energy crops such as polonia plantations which guarantee the supply of fuel in the long term. NASA's patented biomass gasification process is based on Kirkos technology and has been improved over 10 years of research and development in Spain. The process begins after receiving the biomass and converting it into a homogeneous fuel. An automated process receives the biomass and dries it in a patented deep bed drying system. Once prepared in size and moisture, the biomass is transported and fed into the gasification system, which is the heart of the plant. In the bubbling fluidized bed reactor, biomass, air and catalyst react, generating more than 40 major thermochemical reactions with an homogenized reducing environment and control temperature and pressure conditions. This process produces a gas called synthesis gas or syngas. The syngas exits the reactor at 800 degrees Celsius and must be conditioned before being used in combustion engines. The syngas conditioning system consists of two fundamental stages. The first stage consists of high efficiency cyclones which separate the solid particles of char and ash. In the second stage, the syngas is subsequently cooled and cleaned ensuring optimum conditions for energy use in cogeneration systems. Fueled by the syngas, the cogeneration modules trigger a generator that produces energy, which is fed into the grid. Moreover, these internal combustion engines produce useful heat at two temperature levels, thus increasing the added value of available heat. The cogeneration modules are developed by GE Genbacher, a company that has vast and proven experience in cogeneration with special gases such as syngas, with references of more than 40 megawatt in gasification applications. With NASA's technology, it's also possible to substitute fossil fuels with renewable energy in direct thermal applications. A syngas is burnt directly in thermal units such as gas boilers, dryers and ceramic kilns. The entire process of obtaining biomass and its subsequent gasification has a minimal environmental impact, meeting all the EU's current regulations. It's a clean, ecological and sustainable process. NASA and Keiko have strived to update and improve both the gasification and gas cleaning technologies over the past recent years. NASA specializes in the design, manufacture, installation and commissioning of power plants in the 1 to 6 megawatt range using GE Genbacher engines. has the most advanced gasification technology in Europe in full commercial operation, generating both electrical energy and fossil fuel substitution in thermal processes, and thus achieving sustainable green energy production.